dead man. Dead man walking. But you ain't walking now. Come on, guy, get up. Mm -mm. Oh, not today, huh? All right, well, the doctor would like to see you. Or would you rather she came to you? No, I'll go to her. All right. Hey, you okay? You need anything? Yeah, a change of scenery. What? You're getting tired of my handsome looking face already? All right, partner, gotta go. Oh yeah? Now it gets interesting. Actually, you've already seen the most interesting part. To the lieutenant? Did she really do that? Yep. We shacked up outside the nearest village. Heard there was some VC. Middle of the night, we woke up to Lieutenant Hanson screaming. The girl was gone. So, where is she now? Another village, maybe? Terrorize some more locals. What? Come on, man. Who told you? Told me what? Man, this is like a joke that's going around the regiment. <laughs> I heard this crazy chick story twice before. Man, it really happened. Look, someone started spreading this around a month ago. So, come on. Fess up. Who told you? Charlie! Get your funky ass up. Hope you enjoy being cable buddies. Be back in one hour. any threats in recent weeks to your life or dangers? None whatsoever. So then, why all of the security? You barely leave this mansion. We do work in Africa, Agent Lucas, and it would be unwise not to take precautions. What was the meeting in the hotel about? That was of British interest. There may be more black gold in the West African basin than in any other deep sea in the world. Today's meeting was intended to create business strategies to persuade Nigerians to reconsider their position. Strategies? Financial incentives. Someone in Nigeria didn't want that meeting to be successful. Nigerians have always been my friends, even in moments more pressing than these.